Here's the matchup. These two, a man who rises to the occasion. Angeles Fraser Riley Fraser, talk to us about the tale of the table. This by playing mentally and being strong and then showing up here. Malo nearly came back playing with his racket backwards. Toronto to start it off with the serves. Love all. But in terms of his power, opponent is what they're capable of. The shot maker from way behind the table creeps his way. Pretty aggressive fish there. Look at well, number three, it sounds obvious, but you could say it is the best. Around the net, and he follows it up with a jumping backhand. We'd love to watch this one from every angle possible. He's a thick set guy, but he moves so swiftly here. Wow. I think it was just over the net, but it looked like it could have been still. Yeah, you could say over the height of the net. It seemed like it was wider than the post. Mm. Little reminder as we come into the best thing to witness right now. The two players that have dominated the most in the last 10 years. It's cool to... Five serving two. Well played here, little seven-year-olds more mature in the game. Part about as well, you know, he reflected. A so in the last four, sort of five years, unbelievable. Quinn, just up by one. Oh, it's a little bit wide there. It's a sharp edge. A lot of chips too, so. More than the Shasha fans. And then a big one here for Hugo's second serve. And training only with the backhand. What a cover in the middle on this one. He had to straighten up and twist. Slow spin but adaptable on the other side. Leon Yang seems to take the forehand a little bit later sometimes. The lob as high as can be. Where did the ball go? It never came down. To infinity and beyond. Did this just leave the stratosphere around the net once again? Liang Jingquin, heavy side spin. I'm curious if it got caught in the lights. Oh, no, there it is. Off the edge of the racket. It was the Cali throughout the match with Fan Zhongdong in 2021. Liang Jingquin, strong attack. He's playing it into the middle. Heavy rotation on this one, a quality point. I'm just saying, contain it, come over it more. Soft hands to sponge up the spin. Again inside the bait. <laughs> so you've hit my limit. <laughs> Two more. The long push deep to the baseline, surprising. He's using his peripheral to go against the grain, go against the body weight transition of Calderana. Another one of these balls where we just... Sound like dragging your finger on a balloon. Oh, goosebumps. Oh, oh. Oh. Sorry about that. That extra muscle for the hustle inside the... Quinn. Mm. But that side spin on the brushing backhand sends Hugo Calder, leading man for Brazil. Of course, he keep, keeps raising his standards. Before, there's a lot to fight for, for a man who started late. It is so tough, like nails, Leong Jing Quinn Han. Pressure near the baseline. He sets it up with the professional table tennis in. 
Some of the best in the world there. Oh, Backhand inside the table. This is where Calderano needs to be. Anything he can do in this short game to stay. Second towel break here. Two points in front. The thrill from Brazil. Interesting. Now, in that's his. Good pressure from a step behind. This is the power. Then there's going to be a big question mark hanging over Liang Jinquin's head. That could actually get in the way of his vision, too. It's surprising because it looks like he's going to flick, and then he leaves it short and awkward. Where does this one come from? It is four game points. This is the cunning. Down, but four opportunities here to tie it up. Backhand does it as quick as can be, and a fist raised with some subtle satisfaction till the last moment. Shirt count was at three yesterday on WTT social media. The table. One game apiece, leveled out now. The thrill from Brazil with seven of the last eight points. Ugo. Changing up a bit, what do you think? It snowballs for him. Does a good job here with that short stroke forehand to get the ball back. Quinn survives the craziest shots, chops, fishing, counters, that had everything. That net at the end might have been the only thing that could stop Calderano in this mood. Similar to how we saw game number two finish. Yeah, that flip of his toes on his left foot were off the ground when he played that. I thought you said he had left home and I was thinking, yeah, at the age of 14. <laughs> Two points down here, Liang Jinquin fighting. <laughs> in the fifth, came back to go on and win the match, I think, 4 2. But the most heartbreaking of them all. Fresh off the Singapore smash, lost in his first match there against Cho De Song. <laughs> it's there for Liang Jinquin, but. Olympic medal. I think Brazil and the rest of the world will say, all is well. Yeah. Top edge of the racket, doesn't come. He's riding the wave of the Singapore smash. 2-0 down to Not to be forgotten. Liang Jinquin up by three now. Second towel break. You mentioned how good behind here, the thrill from Brazil, the serves out of the second towel break. Six, Close, maybe. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, extra spin. Six of the last eight now for Liang Jingquin. He's taken over the momentum. Oh. Now, I was curious. We saw a little bit of... <laughs> you can hear how much Liang's having to put into this. The big man. But what a point from Calderano. From corner to corner, from the windows to the walls. Get low. And from game 379, it's now 8 9. With the fire within him, a point away from leveling. Hit the shot, Calderano left that empty ball on the table. Calderano came into what was going to... World number three. And he takes it, it means a lot to the man who would love it. The third spot doesn't always get remembered. I'm keeping on that Lady Gaga poker face. Right to the baseline, Calderano from behind. It's the second shout of effort we've heard from Leon Jinquin in recent. Enjoy himself, play his stuff.
Liang Jingquin here. Man, <laughs> the drama. <laughs> Under the. the idea. Good spin from the. Do you remember the colors? That's right. <laughs> told the coin was yellow and green from our production team. A little bit off the top of the net to make it not reach Liang Jingquin, but it is not easy to stay on top of these balls and these high kicking fishing shots. Not a bad seat to have there. Touch from Leon. Four serving, three second serve, Calderano. A taste of his own medicine. Calderano has been so sure is. Knew at the age of 14 he'd have to use that brain. Yeah, it could be hard. Oh, yeah. Liang Jing Quinn right now has done. Yeah. Lob comes down so wide. But the fat single shot. Not the outcome, but what it takes to win for bringing the quality here. Heavy spin slows it down, keeps it low to the net. Tiva, <laughs> got there? Yeah. Remember this. Athletes are regarded internationally. Big point there sets up a two. Think, how can a guy. That strong stay so loose. <laughs> and loose, flexible on the fourth. Cracking counters. <laughs> and the growls and the grunts. A celebration. <laughs> going over to talk to the umpire, it seems. Fascinating. <laughs> Beckman, our umpire, there was some clear frustration. <laughs> Conversation was Calderano to serve. <laughs> that wasn't quite right. <laughs> now, naturally, is a con adjusted. Wow. Oh, the creativity in this to do it. Wraps around the ball with side spin. Down the line, the quick power. Got his big bomber forehand. <laughs> the pace on this one to take it that early. Calderano taking some real. Could have expect Calderano to play all cards on the table stuff. <laughs> as wide as can be. I was surprised the Ang Jing Quinn's gone around the net so many times this game that he went for the wide forehand in this rally. I think it's a clever option because if he goes into the backhand, he knows Calderano will just block cross table. So he plays it wide to wider angle. Goes up 4 2. <laughs> that was quite impressive. That footwork opened doors while in a handstand. <laughs> now, this is one example of how. Brilliant. Leon. So he's got to be smart with his spin and placement. Smart he is with the spin. Spin to win. Doesn't come in low to the net, a little bit higher. Can be used very strategically. Serious. Not too shabby. World number three. Now there's a big think tank. Do they have handling pressure? in 2010. And I say this to a player that I admire. Camps. 
He's been a bit more vulnerable against Europeans. But here, five championship points. The man looking. 23 and now, five opportunities. The Ong Jin Quinn does it. The Ong Jin Quinn, first time he has taken the champion, the title, the championship here at the Champions in Chun. And a big look of respect. He came back last time from down 0-3, but today would not allow himself such danger. Men's singles champion from China, Bian Ding Kun. May we now invite Mr. Sung Min Ryu for the champion's trophy.